Hey guys, welcome back to Hike Oregon and thank you so much for watching my PCT prep series. In today's episode of my PCT prep series, I will be talking all about what water collection and filtration system I'm using and what cook system I'll be using as well. For those of you who are new to my channel, welcome and make sure to check out all of the other PCT prep videos that I have put up prior to this one. For those of you who don't know, I'm hiking the Oregon section of the Pacific Crest Trail starting in July. So let's get into the video. So here's just a little overview of my water collection system, purification system, as well as my cook system here. So it's all pretty lightweight and I'm pretty happy with this setup here. So let's go into water collection and purification first. Basically what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be using the Sawyer Squeeze, which is this guy right here, for water purification. This is my filter. So I will screw this filter onto my Knock Vecto bladder. This bladder holds two liters of water and I can just screw the Sawyer on here and squeeze it through into my smart water bottles. So I'm taking multiple smart water bottles. I'm taking one one liter smart water bottle and one one and a half liter. That'll be two and a half liters for drinking. And then I always have the knock Vecto as backup for an extra two liters. So I can in total carry four and a half liters for some of those sections where we have to, you know, hike more than 20 miles or um, dry camp or something like that. I am really bad at stopping to drink water when I'm hiking. I just like to hike and drink. So I've devised this little system here. Since I didn't want to take a water bladder with a hose, I decided to just take the hose and put it into the smart water bottle so that the smart water bottle can sit like in the side pockets of my backpack and then I can still drink with the hose. That way I don't have to pull these out and stop to drink and stuff like that. So it still makes it super easy. So that's basically my water filtration system. Now let's go over to my cook system. Also really fairly simple, easy, straightforward system. I have my Pinnacle Soloist pot right here. I have backpacked with this pot quite a bit. I really like it. It works really well. The lid's a little bit dinky, but other than that, it works super awesome. It's a great size for what I need to cook. And then I put that pot onto my MSR rocket pocket. This thing folds out and gets put onto my gas canister. I'm taking this without the really heavy duty, it comes with a really heavy duty container, but I'm not going to do that. The pocket rocket sits on this. I'm just taking a bunch of these mini ones because they fit nicely into the pot. And for eating, I'm basically just eating out of the pot with this Sea to Summit long-handled spork. This will work great. As you can see, I can really get down in there. Or if I wanna eat out of a mountain house bag, which I don't really like doing, I can easily get into the mountain house bag as well. For breakfast, I like to have coffee with my breakfast. So I am taking, this is definitely a luxury item, my Sea to Summit collapsible mug. The other thing I really like about this is that it does have measurement lines on the inside. There you can see on the inside. And so when stuff calls for like, you know, one cup of water or one and a half cup of water, this can easily be used to measure out the water, which is awesome. So you might wonder what the heck is this plastic thing for? This is for my lunches. I'm mainly going to be cold soaking lunches. I'm gonna be doing couscous and stuff like that, but I don't wanna be cooking for lunch. So I'm gonna pour everything in here, put water in here, 
This will be my cold soaking jar. And to wipe everything out, like, you know, wash out my pot and stuff, I do have a specific pack towel. As you probably saw in my toiletries and first aid video, if you haven't, I'll link that here, but I do have another pack towel for like myself, like my face and arms and whatever else I'm washing but this is specifically for the pot. These get kind of nasty, so I didn't want to use the one pack towel and have it, you know, be for my face and my pot. That's a little bit gross. So yeah, that's basically all I'm taking as far as cook setup and water setup goes. So thank you so much for watching this episode of my PCT prep series. Again, don't forget to check out my website, hikeoregon.net. And make sure to check me out on Instagram, hike.oregon. I post a ton of photos of all of my most recent hikes. If you have any questions about any of this gear, all the details will be linked in the more info box below. I'll have all of the links to all of the products as well as to my lighterpack.com where you can see all of the gear that I'm taking compiled in one area. So thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you on the next adventure.